So what's going on guys, it's your boy Zombie Kid, and today I, I'm going to be talking about Season 4 in Modern Warfare. Now I think it was a trailer or it was just a breakdown video of what's going on so far in Modern Warfare. And honestly, I don't think it's even a trailer, I, I just think it's just a, like, a recap of what, um, what, what's going on in Modern Warfare. That's overall story pretty much. But anyways, I'm going to be talking about Season 4 in Modern Warfare because it's about to come out soon. And surprisingly, it's gonna come out next week on the on a Wednesday. Surprise! Usually, all the games come out like in um, or at least all the seasons come out in um, uh, in Tuesday. But this year, it's 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 pretty different. But this is like my third time recording this, so yeah. So yeah, as far as, far as I saw this trailer, I saw two new weapons. I saw the Vector, and I saw I think I saw the Galil. And of course, we have two new operators. We have Captain Price, of course. Our baby boy Price is finally coming back, and of course, our boy Kyle Garrix, which. If you guys don't know, if you don't know who Kyle Garrix is, I'm gonna, I'm gonna let you guys complete the campaign first. But if you did complete the campaign, he's, um, spoiler alert, by the way, he is Gas from COD 4. That's right, guys, it's the same Gas that died in COD 4 by the hand of Sakaya. But anyways, those, those two are, like, the new operators, and people were talking about that Iskra was a new operator, but no. People kept saying that there's, like, three new weapons as well, which, no. And the one that Iskra is holding is probably, like, the... Uh, LMG or it's an Odin. I'm not sure which one of those weapons are, but they look very similar to each other. So yeah, it's safe to say that season four will be a good thing. Like it will be a good season so far, at least in my opinion. The only thing I'm worried about is that it, I don't know how Infinity War is going to handle this. It's mainly because they're in homes, like they're at their houses. They're not working in their, you know, in their usual places, you know. Which is why it worries me to actually say like, oh my god, Infinity War, don't screw this up. Not to the point where I'm actually going to say, oh my god, this this thing is going to be trash. But what I am worried about. It's the way it's gonna turn out. Like I said, since they're working at home, I don't even know how this season's gonna go, but we're gonna have to wait and see, you know? Also, um, there's been like a rumor, or at least I think it's confirmed at this point. If you look at the season four logo in the end of the, the trailer or the mini recap video, you're gonna see Scrapyard from Modern Warfare 2 in the like season four logo. It's a season four, of course, but if you look really closely, it's literally Scrapyard from Modern Warfare 2, which I am pretty excited about, but the only thing is, is that, Oh man, it's gonna there's gonna be a lot of campers in that fucking map. But yeah, that's pretty much it for like the season four, you know, season four trailer. There's really nothing else I can talk about, and I'm pretty sure this is not gonna be a trailer. This is probably gonna the trailer's probably probably gonna drop like in Tuesday next week. At least that's what I think. I don't know. I I just think that this is not a trailer. It's just like a little sneak peek of what's gonna come. Oh my god, of course this guy's wearing. Oh my god, you're disgusting. You know that, right? But yeah, I might make a World War Two video later on, just talking about how it's free and what you can expect from World War Two. Cause I'm not gonna lie, Call of Duty World War 2 is probably one of the most underrated games of all time. Maybe because people hated on it a lot, like back in the old days. People thought it was like the worst Call of Duty game, people thought that they, they didn't have like a lot of content. But honestly guys, there is a lot of content in World War 2 right now. First we have the multiplayer, which to me is why probably one of, one of the best multiplayers we've seen in such a long time. It has so much content, it has like fun game modes like Drop and Infected. I think it had, no, no, it didn't have Drop Zone, but it did have some other game modes that are pretty recognizable. It's been a while since I went to World War 2, so I'm, I'm actually pretty excited to actually see how much the, the, the game actually introduced some new players. Also, this, these purple tracer rounds look so cool, I, I'm in love with it. If you guys don't know what the purple tracer rounds are, it's, they're, they're just like guns that shoot purple bullets. It's, it's so cool. If you guys want to go ahead and check it out, I highly recommend it because this thing is probably like one of the best tracer packs, if not the best tracer packs in Modern Warfare. Next to the puppy, probably to the pink tracer rounds since you know I love pink and purple, so they're pretty cool. And no, that does not mean I'm gay, I just like the colors. I don't know why I do actually. But yeah, for me, as far as I can tell, I just hope that it's actually pretty good. I don't, I don't really hope that season four is like, you know bad and stuff. Because personally for me, I do like Scrapyard from Modern Warfare 2, and I remember dropping like a nuke on the last second, but I, I didn't even get it to call it, and that was just so sad. Okay, but I think I'm gonna end it here. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you did enjoy, please leave a like. I'm sorry if this video was actually pretty short. It's because, well, there's really nothing else I could talk about for Modern Warfare, especially because there's just like a mini trailer that's going on, and it's just, you know, a recap of the story. So really, I have nothing else to talk about for Modern Warfare. So once again, thank you guys so much for watching. If you did enjoy, please leave a like. Subscribe to the channel if you're new and hit that notification bell so you know so you don't miss any new videos. But yeah, I'll see you guys later in another video. Adios.